My Jesus, I place all my sins before you. In my estimation, they do not deserve pardon, but I ask you to close your eyes to my want of merit and open them to your infinite merit. Since you will to die for my sins, grant me forgiveness for all of them. Thus, I may no longer feel the burden of my sins, a burden that oppresses me beyond measure. Assist me, dear Jesus, for I desire to become good no matter what the cost. Take away, destroy, and utterly root out whatever you want in me that is contrary to your holy will. At the same time, dear Jesus, will you mind me so that I may walk in your holy light? Blessed me at your most holy feet, O dear Jesus, to manifest to you my gratitude for the continual favors which you have bestowed upon me and still wish to bestow upon me. As many times as I have invoked you, O Jesus, you have made me content. I have often had recourse to you, and you have always consoled me. How shall I express myself to you, dear Jesus? I thank you, yet one more grace I desire of you. O oh my God, if it would be pleasing to you, If you were not omnipotent, I would not make this request, O Jesus. Have pity on me. May your most holy will be done in all things. O my crucified Jesus, behold me at your feet. Do not cast me out. Now that I appear before you, as a sinner, I have offended you exceedingly in the past. My Jesus, but it shall be so no longer. Before you, O Lord, I place all my sins. I have now considered your own sufferings and see how great is the word of that precious blood that flows from your veins. O oh my God, at this hour, close your eyes to my want of merit, and since you have pleased to die for my sins, grant me forgiveness for them all, that I may no longer feel the burden of my sins. For this burden, dear Jesus, oppresses me beyond measure, Assist me, my Jesus, for I desire to become good, whatsoever it may cost. Take away, destroy, utterly root out all that you find in me, contrary to your holy will. At the same time, I pray to you, Lord Jesus, to enlighten me, that I may be able to walk in your holy light. Amen. Saint Gemma, pray for us. O holy Gemma, I am near you. Help me to pray. You know what I and those near me need. Look after my urgent needs and my spiritual and material ones. You take care of them. I confide in you and entrust all to your loving care. 
offer up to Jesus that tender and constant care that you bore him here on earth. O Holy Gemma, you who physically suffered all the pains of the passion of Jesus, I beseech of you the grace to meditate on and live the passion of Jesus and the sufferings of Holy Mary. Pray that I may be able to walk in the path of humility, simplicity, love and sacrifice, fulfilling at all times and in all ways the holy will of God. Let me live united with Jesus, the Blessed Virgin Mary, and you for all eternity. Amen. O Saint Gemma, how compassionate was your love for those in distress, and how great your desire to help them. Help me also in my present necessity, and obtain for me the favor I humbly implore, if it be profitable for my soul. The numerous miracles and the wonderful favors attributed to your intercession instill in me the confidence that you can help me. Pray to Jesus, your spouse, for me. Show him the stigmata which his love has given you. Remind him of the blood which flowed from these same wounds, the excruciating pain which you have suffered, and the tears which you have shed for the salvation of souls. Place all this as your precious treasure in a chalice of love, and Jesus will hear you. Amen. O bright flower of heaven, Saint Gemma, mirror of purity and penance, obtain for us the grace of purity and help us against all temptations of the flesh. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Saint Jim, pray for us.